Okay, four, five, six is on the clock here, okay? All right, let's see what's going down, y'all, because it's a lot going on with this. This full moon energy has been very, very, very thick. Like, people have been energy down, uh, down just energy has been thick. It's the full moon energy, plus we have the retrograde energy. All of that energy is pretty thick right now. And uh, four, five, six on the clock. And I just feel like some people are at the point where, you know, the old cycles are over with. I mean, you know, you reflected. And I'm just feeling like it's like, okay, yeah, this is this is over or whatever whatever it is whatever cycle it is you're done with it you know i just feel like it's a it's it's time for a new era for you and i feel like you know that within your spirit yeah clarity truth breakthrough somebody this is giving you clarity right now but yeah you're definitely um yeah justice here you you you're ready to embark on something new here okay and I feel like this is what this this last ascension or this last uh, process that you've been going through. I feel like this is what's really trying to bring you out of this shell here because you've been sacrificing so much for um, what this thing or project or person that you want to, you know, break away from because you feel like it's not of a good benefit to you per se. It may even be keeping you um, stuck here. Yeah. And you feel like there are better opportunities elsewhere for you. Okay. Yeah. You definitely want to end this cycle here. Okay. And I feel like it's going to be um, a shock to somebody. It may be a shock to someone that is that is ending or a shock to yourself that you even want to end something. Yeah, there is going to be a conflict here. Somebody is understanding, too, that something is definitely over with and you've gained victory and you're moving forward here, okay? And you're no longer um, sacrificing yourself for somebody. Somebody is, a, they're not happy about that and they want to win you at all costs. This is Mercury Retrograde as well. Yeah, they want, they are determined here to win you. Somebody, they like you single, abundant, and free and in their face, but you don't want to deal with this. Yeah, but somebody is watching you with the hard eyes here, okay? So, and I believe somebody knows this. That's why they on your tail so hard is what I'm hearing. Uh-huh. Yeah, with the pages. Somebody is spying on you to figure out who you date. And um, that's going to be a problem coming in. The, I'm here in the upcoming year. This person is going to, yeah, because they don't want you. They feel like you cheating on them, but you're not even with them. Hello. Hello. You're not even with this person. Somebody is definitely off balance here, okay? They don't know how to adapt to, you know, um, I'm hearing somebody can adapt to rejection here. Somebody can't adapt to rejection, and they're trying to head you off with everybody, that they, but they can't. You have an efficient connection here, a higher level of connection coming. I feel like your money is getting better, or it will be getting better here um, after this uh, moon here, this full moon. That's why your energy is down and things of that nature. Somebody is trying to drain your energy in order for you not to have energy for nobody else. Mind you, they over here with Carmisha or Carmelo, Carmelo, whatever you want to call him. I don't know. All right. Anyway, um, it's I just don't even know what to say today. These are these are uh two people that are very immature and they're they still act like teenagers here. And they want you to have, why do they want you to communicate with them? Like, anyway, we're gonna, we're, they want you to communicate with them. Like, for what? Like, what do you have? Hold on, y'all. 
They want you to communicate with them four, five, six again and put your guards down. Uh, absolutely not. You know what you get when you put your guards down with this person. So um, I feel like this person is going to try to come in between you and your relationship, but I don't think it's going to work. Um, I don't know why this person just won't move on. Why this person just won't move on? Because they're passionate about you. It's like this is something that they have to win. It's a challenge that they have to win. They never saw anybody leave them alone the way that you did. I guess people just hang on to this person like, ooh, I can't, you know, let go. Yeah, you say bye. You know what I mean? I ain't got time. Yeah, you're holding back. That's what it is about you. You're a challenge to this person. Okay, collective, I think you have moved on here. Yeah, collective, either you're single outside you know what i'm saying living young free happy having fun or you are um yeah that's what you're doing enjoying the fruits of your labor everything like that somebody um You're about to become fearless here. I feel like somebody, you're about to become fearless and just take a leap of faith here. Yeah, where you feel, where you got strength. You're you're trying to keep the strength because you're passionate about something, but you're trying to do something in order to make something else happen. But spirit is saying, lay those burdens down because you're conflicted in your head about it right now. Okay, but it'll end soon. Just. Yeah, you're bored. You're bored with whatever this is, and you know it's not good for you. And some of you are developing habits because you're bored, okay? Some of you may be overeating. Some of you may be uh, shopping. Um, yeah, so. I don't feel like it's drugs. I feel like it's shopping or overeating. You know, y'all like, shit, I mean, I, let me shop or something. Yeah, to balance yourself out, but Spirit is saying, You'll be able to make that choice and decision soon. Just give yourself time, but also be efficient with it as well, okay?